Century City sprang from make-believe, the dream world of a motion picture studio. Celluloid dreams crumpled, famous names among the world's great architects gathered. Pietro Belusky, I. M. Pei, Minoru Yamasaki, and Welton Beckett. Unhampered by existing streets or structures, they began to plan a city from the ground up. They designed wide boulevards, fountains designating over half of the area as green space. Earth movers came to redistribute the dust of yesteryear. Century City's master plan centered on a wide boulevard to be called Avenue of the Stars in keeping with the space age. Along this boulevard would rise a complete city within a city, with all the facilities for business, shopping, living, and leisure. The complex is dominated by spectacular Century Plaza, made up of the Century Plaza Hotel, the ABC Entertainment Center, and twin 44-story triangular office towers, tallest in the complex. With the land cleared away, plans took concrete form. A legion of hard hats moved in. Fantasy became reality as the first gateway buildings were completed. People moved in and brought the city to life. Using nails, nuts, bolts, and bulldozers, men and machines continued to shape a city. They created the world-renowned Century Plaza Hotel. Century Square Shopping Center. And then, three office buildings on the eastern perimeter. The elegant Century Towers apartments, catering to the wishes of the affluent, where every living need is fulfilled in superb surroundings. Century Park East Apartments, key to recreation and the ultimate in services. And along Avenue of the Stars, prestige business structures to meet a growing demand for offices in Century City. Santa Monica Boulevard, 
the Century City North Building, followed by Century Park Plaza. And as it has grown, this new uptown for Los Angeles has become a stopping place for presidents and world leaders, for tourists from all over the nation and the world. Century City rapidly became a hub of human activity, an internationally known address, a self-contained community offering everything people need within a matter of blocks. Everything? Everything. The prime focal point for Century City is magnificent Century Plaza, which encompasses several normal city blocks. Its underground parking facility was the largest land excavation ever made for a building complex. A major feature of Century Plaza is ABC's Entertainment Center, which includes a legitimate theater, two movie theaters, nightclubs, shops, and gourmet restaurants. Opening nights lure the great and the near great in the Western theater world. For the motion picture fan, two luxurious cinemas offer a showcase for Hollywood's first-run features. For late-night live entertainment, there's the West Side Room and the Hong Kong Bar. With the theater buildings of the Entertainment Center completed, Construction is now well underway to complete Century Plaza. Directly behind the entertainment center, twin office towers will soon be a part of the skyline. These 44-story buildings are triangular in shape. The unusual design offers an unobstructed view from all sides of both triangles with complete privacy. These structures will soon house some of the world's top business firms and professional organizations. Underneath Century Plaza is the world's largest subterranean garage, six stories below ground. Connecting Century Plaza with the Century Plaza Hotel is the Grand Promenade, running underneath the beautiful celestial fountain on Avenue of the Stars. The Promenade and Giant Plaza are being lined with specialty shops restaurants and night spots. Among them, the Playboy Club, Harry's Bar, Jade West, La Cuisine, the Trevi Bar and Cafe, and others. To the rear of the Century Plaza Hotel, an additional major garage is planned. And on top of the garage, plans call for tennis courts, a health spa, and other recreational facilities. Just south of the Century Plaza Hotel, along Avenue of the Stars, a major expansion of the hotel complex is planned. 
The concave curve of the new building is designed to complement the convex shape of the original center building. In the years to come, Additional residential and office buildings will be constructed in Century City as the need arises, keeping pace with the latest innovations in building technology. Today, only a decade after its birth, Century City generates its own special kind of excitement. The pencil land of Hollywood has become a shining city of tomorrow today, where Tom Hicks once rode his horses is now Avenue of the Stars. Constellation Boulevard, once the birthplace of films like What Price Glory, How Green Was My Valley, and Century Park East echoes to memories of Jesse James, Miracle on 34th Street, 7th Heaven. Here in Century City, as in days gone by, dreams are still unfolding, dreams that are becoming reality. And as the dream grows, the city will grow until it touches tomorrow. <laughs>